Hello guys, this is Aaron here and this is, uh, well Aaron plays really, and this is me back for another review. This t Today even, I am reviewing Driver. As you know, Driver has been a retro game, has been out the ages ago, I remember playing it on the PS2, so it's old. In the demo you can get it on Xbox and PS3 as far as I know. You can go on to the, what's it called, it's like a, or you can do three missions on it even. Um, the missions are actually pretty good. I am going to show you one now. Sorry, I was just turning up the volume on the mic there. So I'll start one one of the missions now. It's only be 15 minutes long because I can't upload any longer on this channel. Uh, all you need to do is prove to Jungs you can shift. It's basically shifting between two cars. What I don't like about it, it's unrealistic. The graphics look pretty good. However, there's some stupid things in it. He just talks shit for their alt. I'm going to to skip. Objective hit X, follow the jackass, which is the guy right in front of us. So I'm in this car here, which is obviously a taxi, and then you shift into him by hitting A. Then we get this. Like, what is all this about? You have to move, then you have to do like this, and then hit A to go into his car, and then ask me in it. So that is that. So now I have to jump off a car transporter, which is one of these wee yokes. I just need to kind of move back here and drive up this. Obviously you'd love to do it at faster speed, but I just want to get it done and show you this like. Then it does this slow motion kind of shit. So, objective. You just turn straight back into this car, don't know why. Um, just confuses the life out of me. But, what I did notice, is if you drive, try and drive into people, usually in like GTA and all, you drive into them. But look at this. Look how good at shuffling they are. Just look at it. Oh no. Like, look, I'm driving 70 miles per hour and they're just shuffling to the side. It's just so stupid. Right, time to shift into the jackass, so... I happen to lose control of my car, so now I have to tag a cop car. This is actually pretty fun, this bit. Where is the wee cop car? You'll find one scooting about wherever they decide to be. You can see the map if you hit Y, a bigger map comes up, and there's no cop cars about. There's one actually down here. So uh, there's bound to be a cop car soon. Yeah, got a cop car. Oh fuck. Oh bollocks. Oh shit. And then if you hit LB, your guy goes into some like fucking ultrasonic mode. So, just. <laughs> that was some move there. Just breezing the cop car, but so far this game has been. It's been pretty boring, to be honest with you. Uh, I'm not a fan of it. It's not better than the other games. The only thing that's better is the graphics, obviously. Which you would expect. So now I have to lose the cop cars, as you can see in the radar, there's a radius you have to stay in between. And I'm gonna lose the cops in ten seconds. This has been a better round for me, like <laughs> it usually takes me quite a long time. And I've lost the cops. Oh I haven't even. Oh bollocks. Right, I'll lose them now though. See look at this, like how fucking awkward is this driving? This is me hitting LB, they like go NOS or something and the, the driving is awkward as fuck. What's all this about like? So, I'm going to try and put the NOS on again just to lose these ones quickly. I don't want this video lasting forever. Come on. See what I mean? Like, look at the fucking steer of that driving. Driving is atrocious. I'm gonna try and go up here and lose him. Yeah, I'm gonna lose him in a few seconds here, hopefully. Like, look at the state of this driving. It's ridiculous. Right, that's me escape the cops. So. Now, it's good the way you can have like a couple of good wee missions in this. So, objective, lose the cops, which is done. And I think the next bit, yeah, you shift back into his car. And then, oh, the, it's just so fucking shit, like. Have to hook to a throw truck. Shift to Jack Ash yet again. So, all well, you can shift between two cars. This was like... Oh, I can't remember what game it was. But, shift into the tow truck. Here's the tow truck. All you need to do, drive into the back of it. And I just, how shit is that? Realistically, like, that is that mission done. 
Jones is now a believer. Wow, you can you can shift between cars just out of the blue, and you can drive into the back of a tow truck. So uh, this is basically the end of this review. Um, I'm giving this a rating of four out of ten, uh, simply because it's not that good. Um, it's just unrealistic. The graphics and all are smashing. Like I mean, graphics are good, but in terms of gameplay, I know I've already done one mission. You can actually do three missions when you download the demo, uh, but they're just not good at all. So, rating a four out of ten. Thank you for watching. Hope, uh, hopefully, I can talk to you soon. And uh, please like the video. It helps the channel grow. And subscribe to me it means a lot as well. Thank you very much, guys. See you soon.